We are here today in Beverly Hills in the backyard of Michel Bovat, pioneer and creator of the label Bizu Bizu, and all around creative woman. She is an artist, a master yogi, and the mother of seven. So Michelle, tell us how you got connected with yoga originally and why that was powerful for you. I got connected um, in 1992. And uh, is one of my friends, uh, she advised me to take a yoga teacher because I uh, was working very hard. I had uh, just my fifth child and uh, opening stores and being in the fashion is a very stressful uh, business. And I had this guilt to let the kids uh, at home. I didn't want to go in the gym or to dance anymore like I used to in the past. And I say, yoga, why not? You know, let's try. After uh, first, second classes, my life changed completely. What what kinds of things did you notice shifting? Like, was it external or was it relationships? Well, it, it was it was everything. It was everything. I was becoming, uh, you know, this wife and go to work and running the kids and nervous woman. You know, if it, when I look back, I look at this woman and I say, she was not happy. She had everything. You know, I had a house. I had a beautiful husband. I had the kids. Had the business, you know, from outside, everybody would say, oh, she has it. But inside, something was missing. I didn't know what. And I realized that uh, I was not on the right path for me. So I had to make a change. I had to change my relationship with my husband, uh, with my children. And this was, I think, my best, best, uh, my biggest challenge and my biggest success also because. Um, a lot of people uh, think that they need to remove something out of their life in order to grow themselves. I don't believe at all at that. I would add into it. So I wanted to keep my husband loving me even more, my children also, to overcome the fear, to show who I am, what I wanted, to speak my voice, and to start doing what I wanted to do mm -hmm. with my life without breaking everything, without changing, because people don't like change. You know, people love to see their mama that they used to, you know, they don't want to have another one. My husband didn't want to have another wife. So I had to be very smart about it. And so you have to breathe yoga morning and night and think every day and make sure you are stress free, that you can handle it. Like I told you uh, just before, everything that you do in life, you have to do it with pleasure. Because what counts is your happiness and people are going to feel it, and it's energy. Everything in life is energy. And when you understand what energy is about, you start controlling it, and you use it in your own way, for you and for others. And everything changes. So I was wondering, for you, how does the art feed the yoga? How does the yoga feed the art? I think it's connected. I think yoga helps the creativity. So when you are with yourself, you really communicate with, within yourself, you tap into your creativity and all the chakra and the system nervous open up, you know, to deliver a message to yourself. And when I paint uh, the yoga poses, I, it's a healing art. I'm using colors uh, that has to do with your chakra and it's a message and I put a lot of energy into it. And before emitting anything, I take three big breaths and I expand my energy all over my body, all the way out, you know, and then I receive and I give and I nurture, it's a, it's a nurturing thing, ball, big fire of energy that opens my creativity. And you have seven children. Yeah, absolutely. This body has seven children. I have seven children. Amazing. And um, my secret, um, one of my secrets, because I have a few secrets, but one of them is um, in life, don't ask yourself too many questions. Huh? Just move on, do, and take pleasure at every single thing that you do. What's your favorite yoga pose right now? Like, what's what um, 
What's something that you practice? I like to do uh, inverted poses. Mm -hmm. You know, I like to to bring my head down and to have the blood coming into my face. It really relaxes my face, my muscles, gives some fresh blood to my heart, uh, re refresh my kidney, my abdominal, and strengthen my back. So I think working with the spine, I love everything which is working with the spine because the spine has uh, the, uh, the center of the nervous system and from here goes from the spinal cord, goes all the nerves and irrigate all the part of our body. So you go to the top and to the roots, to the bottom. So I think it's a good uh, element for me. And I work with my fire energy, my solar plexus.